What's going on, Extreme Gang? It is Monday, the start of the week. Oh, what a Monday, huh? I'm tired already. Well, we got our results in right in front of us from BGS, and who I use for our BGS services will be linked in the description in case you too want to use him. Um, I do know he's capped per week now, so I think like everything he got last week goes in this week, and then he's starting for next week's orders. Uh, normally, he used to be able to drop off every day, but because of the slowness, they've been uh, capped to guys like doing stuff like that. So let's take a look. I kind of know what we already got because he sends me a picture when they're graded. But I still thought it would be kind of cool to do. Plus, you guys get to see uh, firsthand this stuff. But boom. So, all these were either pulled by myself, I could have won it in a Raz. Um, actually, I take it back. All but this one here. I want this here is the only part I won that is a Raz win. It's quad nine five. It's the 2019 Tops Gold PD Alonzo. Let me. I'll take it out because I'm gonna be recasing these anyhow here, but uh, or rebagging them. But as you can see, very nice card. This might have been something I probably should have sent to PSA. And got a 10 out of, but I was kind of curious on to it. And I figured, what the heck, we'll send in with Sappy. He does very well with us. He's our number now, 2019, since his last year's. So, we haven't really had much of him. Um, I heard much of him this year. It's all been a kuna, kuna, kuna. But it'll be held back for a while until uh, good old Gary V says he's going for Pete Alonzo's. Next, we pulled this out of the pack. John Morant. Centering got a 9, and I know it was because of top and bottom on this, if you really look. I was hoping they would still come back with a 9-5, so I am very blessed on to that. And they don't sell for a whole lot. I think these are around $150, maybe grade 9-5, off the look. They just want to pick up the steam, but really cool looking card. The, this will be available on my, 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 my Slabs account. How do you like that? So, we also pulled his uh, friend, Zion. Same exact thing. I knew the top and bottom was going to get me out of it. So, we, we went with back it because otherwise this would have been probably a PSA 9 because of centering. They're more about the centering. So, we did get 9.5 on surface and everything else was 9.5. So, it's a min gem. Oh, I don't know why I was flipping around for an auto. Actually, nothing I had was auto. This uh, I just sent three cards off to him today, so we'll see. Uh, let's do this one. This I was kind of. They say surface was a nine on this. I was more worried. And I think what it was was I did see like this, like the printer marks in the back, which probably got this. And I was just curious how they were going to grade it. I'm trying to remember if that this was the one or not. I'm pretty sure it was. Yeah, because I could barely see it on the back. So if you do a printer lines, you're probably looking at a surface of being a 9 onto it. I was hoping to get some t a 10 for centering. This was really well centered compared to what I've set in. But, again, this would have came back a PSA 9, probably more than likely. So went to BGS route. The other card I pulled, this is a long, long time ago. I finally got around to grading it. Again, it's Morant's uh, friend. Zion Green Quad Nine Five. Now this one here, I kind of was gonna do Beckett with because the centering looked real good. I didn't have no printer lines or marks onto it. I'm trying to see if I can get to read better. There we go. It was just a beautiful looking card. We got rid of the silver already. The last I checked, these were like five hundred. There was a, I think a couple of sales around a six hundred dollar range. And I think I'm going to end up keeping this for a while, at least probably to one of the shows. That way people could be like, ooh, he's got Zion type deal. But overall, really good grades. Five for five, nine fives. With two of them being true gems, the Alonzo and the Williams. The Morants and the other Zion. Huh, take it. Nine fives. So like I said, these two here are probably my favorite just because they quad nine five. You know, I'm a real big quad nine five person. I don't like seeing them nine subs onto it. That's just me. So, again, thank you, everybody, for always watching the video. This was a 
quick, quick BGS results. There's only five cards. I just sent them three because I don't want to send a lot at a time anymore. I want other people to be able to get their stuff in with his weekly subs. But we set on the Zion Blue from Select, Light Blue. The out of 10 Reddish Rookie Auto from Select. And then the Premier Level Zion. We'll see what happens because, I mean... I'm a little worried about the blue because I've seen the real light lines onto it, but I think they could be pretty much wiped out. So we'll see. Other than that, uh, PSA, it might be a long time. I'm, I have stuff for PSA, and I'm just looking at it. And the more I keep on kicking myself, I should have did it three weeks ago because I'd already have 15 days probably knocked up. Well, they probably would at least just got logged in. But the 30-day subs are like now 63 business days. So when you take into consideration, if there's four weeks in a month, that's 20 days there. You're looking at over three months until they can get it graded. So I got to get those Zion Prism bases out there because I know I got out of those six, I think four I'm on 10. And that, those are $800 a pop now. Craziness, I say. Thank you, Gary V. Other than that, thank you, everybody. Just don't forget, if you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Like the videos as always. That way we can beat the uh, uh, YouTube algorithm up a little bit. Feel free to make comments. Um, like I said, I'll have Sappy's uh, Facebook page below for where he does all of his grading from. It's a real simple process. He started to do PSA. I it would probably be a little bit yet. He's just starting to get the stuff you know worked out with how to do it. But uh, pretty good stuff. He has a video about it too on his page. Check it out. He just did it yesterday with all the changes. Other than that, thank you as always. Check you guys out on Wednesday where I'll be more like of a live with the 2019 Contenders Optic Foosball. And, oh, I forgot. We'll be live tomorrow too, guys. I got uh, some racing boxes in for somebody. 2020 Don Russ Racing. Come on. Log in when you see me go live because you can make fun of me with racing. It'll just be as bad as when we first started basketball. And I'm like, blah, 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 guys. CQ, Doomba, Booba. Well, yeah, I'm done with it. Type names. Because I can't pronounce half those things anymore. All right. I'll talk to you all later.